My name is Eva Yamanaka and I love to learn. I go to High Hill School on the Big Island. Here's a poem me and my mommy wrote. It is called Monkey See, Monkey Do. So, you have 30 little monkeys in your class this year. You're already a ball stress. Maybe you cried a tear. The work of 30 monkeys, piles of paper you have to grade. The noise of 30 monkeys, oh boy, you need an aid. 30 monkeys using the glue, 30 monkeys tying their shoes. 30 monkeys taking your cue, 30 monkeys all eyes on you. Monkey see, monkey do. Show us the examples how to love our years in school. To grow our love of learning, show us things we never knew. Do more than teach us basics, show us how they all relate to the world around us. Guide us to create. Inspire us to do more than just the average stuff. If you show you really care, the work won't seem so tough. 30 monkeys learning what's new, 30 monkeys in pairs of two. 30 monkeys in your canoe, 30 monkeys pick you coo coo. But monkey see, monkey do. I know you must be tired after years of silly monkeys, and I'm sure you had your share of students less than spunky, but each year brings new monkeys on the first day of class, excited to be in the second grade, a big kid at last, our eyes as big as pancakes, we will not move a muscle, it just takes one special teacher, and we'll complete our work with hustle. If you show you really care, we'll want to make you proud. Think big thoughts, dream big dreams, and stand out in a crowd. Dirty monkeys playing kazoos, dirty monkeys eating beef stew, dirty monkeys still brand new. Dirty monkeys need you to break through. Because monkey see, monkey do. Working in education, we have opportunities to shape the lives of our learners. But today, we now have the opportunity ourselves to be the learner. To take in knowledge and professional development to better our methods, our skills, and refine our art of teaching so that we can reach the heart of our students. Everything that you do matters. Let's hear from two students that you've made a difference for. What I like about school is how you get freedom and how you're able to do anything to make new friends and be able to share friendships with them and be able to go connect and you have huge freedom and not always locked inside a cage that you feel. What I like about what I like about the teachers is how the doors are always open and how they're able to be there for you and greet you in the morning when you're having a really bad day. Education has taught me that I'm not alone and that I don't have to be alone to be a better person, to achieve what I want. I've always had teachers who've, who've made me want to be a better person, who not just taught inside the classroom experience, they've been my mentor, they've been my advisor, and because of that I know who I want to be and what I need to do in order to get there. So after high school I'm planning to go to a four-year university, most likely in Seattle University, hopefully. I probably most likely would like to major in psychology, sociology with a major in philosophy. So I believe that those majors will help me go into law school and from law school I want to become a lawyer and help with. I want to give the voice to those who don't necessarily have the tools to speak out for themselves. I really like to thank all the people who helped me grow throughout high school. Throughout high school I was just, at the freshman year I was a very, very shy person. But now thanks to student council, student government, I'm much more confident than I ever thought I'd ever be. I'm exploring different possibilities I never thought was possible. And because of that, I'm who I am now. We want to thank you for all your hard work that you do for the students. You matter, and we appreciate all that you do. Here to set the tone for today's activities, let us hear from our complex area superintendent. 
We'd like to welcome you to your complex-wide professional development day. It's going to be a great day of learning that you focus on our complex area-wide areas of focus for 2016-2017. The first, of course, being our back-to-basics approach. We want to see common core instruction in every classroom, every day, by every teacher. The second part that we're focusing on is what we're calling leadership for action. Last year, we did leadership for planning. We had a lot of our focus spent on coming up with ideas about how we can improve as a complex area. This year, we're going to implement those plans, so we need leadership for action and not just planning. Finally, and that's what today is all about, is we want to focus on growing our people. We want to provide you guys with the professional development and support and time for collaboration that you're going to get today so that Hilo Complex can truly function as a K-12 entity. So enjoy your day, wish you guys the best, and I'll see you around campus.